welcome friends so good to have you back we're talking about being strong in god being firm in god uh, no matter what season uh, we are going through in life and today i want to focus on uh, another value if you want to call it a character which is important for us to be firm in god and stand uh, strong and this is excellence now when we talk about excellence we all recognize that it has to do with doing our best and doing things to the highest standard now when we talk about um, uh, excellence we also see in scripture that the spirit of god is called as a spirit of excellence uh, daniel is a wonderful example from um, the old testament of a man who who excelled in everything that that was committed to him uh, and we also see that there is a comparison between him uh, and others you know or, or people of his times and uh, we're told that he was recognized for the excellent spirit which was in him so the king recognized him for the excellent spirit uh, but we also uh, know that the spirit that he carried was a spirit of revelation understanding knowledge and that is the same spirit in Isaiah 11:2 we read about the holy spirit described in all these ways so the holy spirit is able to impart excellence in our lives uh, and today i just want to encourage us whatever it is that we are called to let us pursue excellence uh, even when we consider our spiritual walk with the lord we could have started uh, at a certain level um with god but we see that scriptures are always calling us to maturity and maturity has to do with us becoming like jesus or being conformed into the image of the lord jesus christ there is a passage in second peter chapter 1 verses 5 through 9 where the believer is being called to the next level and the next step so i just want to read this for us from verse 5 says but also for this very reason giving all diligence add to your faith virtue to virtue knowledge to knowledge self control to self control perseverance to perseverance godliness to godliness brotherly kindness and to brotherly kindness love if these things are yours and abound you will be neither barren nor unfruitful in the knowledge of our lord jesus christ for he who lacks these things is short sighted even to blindness and has forgotten that he was cleansed from his old sins do we notice here that you know god is calling us to a higher walk with him you know if we thought that we have already developed diligence in us you know it's as if god is saying come on add faith to that now if we if we uh, thought that we have faith God is saying come on add virtue to it so you know God is really stretching us and calling us to a place where we can become like his son and represent his son the Lord Jesus well to the world out there and in addition to that we are called to fruitfulness we are called to um, uh, thriving and flourishing uh, in Christ Jesus and this is God's heart for all of us you know god does not want us to remain at the level where we are but he says come up higher um grow and become mature move towards go on to maturity and friends i just want to encourage us you know let's take that step ahead uh, let's uh, make a better decision uh, let's put in that effort and trust that you know god will keep uh, honing us and you know uh, causing us to grow in him and pursue excellence let's pray together heavenly father thank you lord thank you that uh, um lord your dreams for us are so great that lord you want us father to uh, to say yes to you and father god yield to you and and come up higher in you father i just pray for that spirit of excellence which rested upon jesus which rested upon daniel to rest upon your people lord lord let that excellence be seen in each one of our lives and in everything that we do we honor you we give you the glory lord in jesus name we pray amen thank you for tuning in to living supernaturally 
For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.